Yeah, in this video we're going to take a look at cleaning the VAT valve seat where your blade from the VAT valve seats against the uh, seal. And But first I want to show you the, the blade itself and the seal so we can see how it works. It, it's actually a bonded seal that starts and goes around, takes a little turn here and comes around, does the same thing at the bottom and so you can see that that seat is a little different so with the groove that, the groove that this part here goes into is going to be on one side of the chamber and then this goes up against the seat on the other side so when we're cleaning it out it'll make a little more sense if you see how this seat actually what it looks like. Okay I wanted to get this camera angle you can see this is where we would put the valve in it would slide into here your blade would go into this this slot but for to make it easier for us to see I'm gonna get a camera angle that's shooting into here now normally we would have an in feed here and we wouldn't be able to even get in here but just to make it a little easier for you to see you can get to all of it from in here but I just can't get the camera in there so I'm gonna reset the camera and show us uh, what we have on the inside of this with the bat valve blade seat into the bat valve Okay, we've adjusted the camera angle now. We're kind of shooting in where you would not normally be able to see. And I'm, I'm going to poke a stick in through here, a little pointer, into where the valve valve would go. It would go into here. And I'm going to just point out a few things. And what I want to point out is this little curve right here. If we remember what the valve valve seal looked like. It would seal up against here, down, around, and then up the, up the back side. The reason I'm pointing this out is this is where we need to take a Q-tip in here and clean all this out. I'm going to get another camera angle and uh, widen the view so we can get a better look at the whole thing. Okay, we widen the view a little bit so that it, we can see I'm poking. This is where your blade would go and you can see my poker coming all the way through. And what we would want to do is clean all of this out as much as we can all the way down to the bottom and clean that out. And then when you get done with that side, we would come in on this side. And this is kind of tough to do because you kind of have to reach around the corner with the Q-tip. But we would have a, another surface on here. I don't know if you can see my pointer inside of here. There is a little surface right there. Let me get it. Anyway, you can actually see it from this side as well. But this, the O-ring goes up against here, it goes down and then up the other side. So the point I want to make is we need to really make sure that this area is well cleaned. 